Hello friends, I give you my phase 3 update of my project the webs. I've been busy trying to make uh, the breath rate monitoring unit which is uh, a pretty complicated uh, component in this project. This is the breath rate monitoring unit. It's strapped on to a person sitting on a chair and you can see the black and orange leads that are coming out. One supplies voltage and the other carries the breath rate signal. We've got a very sensitive accelerometer inside this enclosure that picks up the chest movements. You can see the person breathing and these movements are basically biometric signals picked up by the accelerometer and they are sent to the PIC32 ADC. The ADC basically finds out the zero crossovers of the periodic waveform and then computes the time period and compares that with three different sets of time periods. One which indicates it's a very normal breathing, the upper limit which shows it's a higher breathing, the lower limit shows it's a slower breathing. And slowly I transport these signals onto the PIC32 board. You can see that's the middle one LED which is glowing that's orange in color. It shows that the breath rate is normal. It's about 14-15 breaths a minute to about 26-28 breaths a minute. Now we, we try to slow down the breath and see what happens. The left LED that's green in color glowing it shows that the breath rate has gone down below the lower limit and when you breathe faster you're going to cross into the red limit here comes up red which means the breathing is out of the normal range and when you're back to normal you're going to see the orange LED come back again so what that's what the PIC32 is doing over here here let's take a look at what really happens what are the traces like that's a normal breath which is now going as you can see this is the inflation and this is the release and you can see a, a figure of around 252.5 millihertz that computes to about 12 to 13 breaths a minute and when you breathe faster you see this is going pretty high which means this is going to around 60 breaths a minute and you have very nice periodic waveform showing that the driver has got a very fast breath which is abnormal you'll find this figure changing that's around 18 breaths a minute and you have very nice waves this is you breathe in and you breathe out when you go down on your breath you're trying to breathe very slow which usually happens when you fall off into sleep or your senses are very slow and you are sliding into some sort of you know dozing or sleeping you'll find that the curve changes and you have a larger time period and there you see the green lamps growing over there. You come back to normal. You have orange. That's a normal breath rate. So that means you can drive the car. And if you are an amphetamine or the driver had a nice peg of whiskey, his breath rate is going to go up. So that's, that's a pretty cool, you know, it works very nicely. So this is a very small update. I'll be back again with more. Thank you all. Thank you very much.